Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Machista Media Projects. Today I have nothing but talent for you guys. I have music, I have an artist, I have an instrumentalist, I have everything for you. It's all about the sounds today. But without any further ado, let me just introduce my guy here. The name is... JSTG Nkulisi, Kamalamlang Veda. Sure, sure, Nkulisi. Nice to have you, Nkulisi. Nice 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 so can you please tell us who is Nkulisi and where is Nkulisi from? Nkulisi uh, is born and raised in Nkulisi in Tembisa. Uh, it's an artist that has started his musical journey um, uh, 14 years ago. 14, oh. Yeah, it's been different experiences, variety of uh, music and creativity from your know, dancing to your singing and musical vocal coaching. And now it got to a point where the police is a guitarist, is a live instrumentalist to be exact. So I perform live and I. I have audio music that I, that I, uh, I would say I'm executing yeah. to showcase what I have. So since you say it's, it's been 14 years, so you, this, this means that it's been there since you were a, a kid. Since so I was a, yeah. In, were, from back in high school, uh, in middle school, in fact, uh, there was a time where I used to hold sessions in a long time class. I would sit there and then I would pretend to be an MC and tell them, Yeah, I'm trying to do this, now I'm shy. And that has developed its own influence into me becoming a standout character. Like yeah. I'm taking leadership in this field of entertainment yeah. and the yeah, music industry. So every we're hosting shows yeah. every Friday in middle school. From middle school I went to high school. In our done middle school that was in Irene Middle School. Okay. From then since Spelamo Grade 9 I went to uh, TKM to Dogi okay. Got there, yo, became like a guru because I had people that I had to teach dancing, people that I was yeah. busy sessioning with, no back when rapping was in, and everybody wanted to become a beatboxer, you know, put their pants here. Yeah. We were those guys, they are cool till I was cramp again. Yeah. Get up in the session, change our faces, and so wear some raggedy clothes. <laughs> but it's all, it's all cool, you know. Yeah. We style like back in then. Now, man, I might train up, God, whatever I might just want to know, trying to, you know, smaller yeah. the package. It's like he's a little alien. But yeah, that also, that experience has proven itself that Umuntu, we actually enjoy when Umuntu are Yeah, evolve. You evolve. Yeah. Yeah, from those people in school, coming back to the people at home. Oh, speaking of people, people at home, I have a project, Manjana Mandwana, Basi Renewable Educational yeah, we'll, we'll touch Project. On that, so. Okay, sure. So yeah, it, it's all the it's all part of the creativity that's bottled inside. Yeah. I think my main drive it, it is to always have some results, yeah, yeah. positive results to a specific. Yeah. So, uh, or yeah, so like you know with music it's not not something that's like regular with parents so like how is that like maybe like you know how do they take it as as okay okay wanna go watch like, some music like is this like a good thing or like did they tell you to go and do it like hey, this hey, hey, and stuff? Hey, for it. <laughs> well I'm I'm guessing being in Canada. Yeah. Um I was raised by a single parent, Duma Wami. She was always supportive of in the games I She would even encourage me to further the experience and find educational premises where I can equip myself yeah. with enough information. So okay, she wasn't always there, like attending my shows, wow, but yeah. the, it's the small things she does. Sometimes you let's know how your koela or why you perform it or Naila and she was Okaula because yeah. you know she was you know unemployed and yeah, yeah I was uh I'm gonna say I'm to say it's a you say volunteer. Yeah. Yeah, even now I'm a volunteer with the uh, S A P S C P F. Yeah. Yeah, patrol uh, last my contract just ended where I was patrolling at a primary school. And tell you about Lomtolo, I got there, I did my job, I did my job. And then you find me teaching kids about music eventually. I don't know yeah, where it comes from. It's just, it comes in the Just boom! Yeah. 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 And then yeah, when it's ya, when it's ya, when it's ya, and it's all sounds so beautiful. In fact, if there was 
at times, we have a lot of videos where we sat all up. With the kids now, we are doing a, a piano. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we are accepting change and musical growth yeah, yeah. Like, in yeah. the industry. That a piano has taken over. Yes, yeah, literally a piano to the world. The first instrument that I was introduced to was a piano. Yeah. Yeah, but I couldn't play it much. And then time goes on. I was given an instrument from a good friend of mine, the school at Apple Room, and we had a home studio. Yeah. And Nabo Les, Nabo Heavy, Heavy Beat Productions, that's my, actually, is my brother, I would say. Shout out to him. Yeah, Heavy Beat Productions. We all fucking came in with yeah. his equipment. They made sure they put me on. And Leslie De Jong, now he's an artist who's now doing big. He's, he had an influence. It's his guitar, actually, that yeah. I was given. And Shout out to too. Yeah, I started playing guitar and that guitar just brought about a new universe into how I see music and yeah. how I did music. Because I used to struggle a lot if the guys were not there yeah. in terms of, yo, I need a beat, guys, I need a beat. You know, you always have these lyrics, but you don't have instrumentals to rap to. Yeah. So the guitar was there and I would just take it, you know, go, go behind my my room where nobody sees, you know, and yeah. yeah, just start playing mm -hmm. notes there. And at that time, I wasn't aware that mm -hmm. there were such things as chords. I was playing this, yeah. everything, every time. Like, oh, if I had a melody, I go, yeah. doesn't even have shape. Yeah. But as long as it has a metronome, then I can keep up and start spitting my bars. So, uh, a good brother of mine, his name is Dominic Sam. He, him, uh, he, wa he wanted to have this huge band, musical band. Yeah. So he, he had a concept of me and him working together in his band. Yeah. And in, in his band, he's a tech tribute. Their the, the brand name is Tech Tribute. There are about three members there. It's him, uh, Dominic Sana, it's Skongo, it's Latitambo. Oh, Dominic Sana is a guitarist and Skomo is a percussionist and they also feature uh, a female male, Musa, you know, she's, yeah. she, she's a vocalist, she's a, she's a male vocalist. Yeah. And yeah, um, it's been quite a journey learning from the guys and the experiences. Yeah. So I've, I've then, I've then I've adapted his teachings and to learn from the show throughout yeah. the years and now yo, I hear that oh, wow I sound beautiful I have I have accent yeah. you know I know about majors and minors I know about there's a natural scale now there's a pentatonic scale it's Lydian scales yeah. and it's just a variety of chords yeah. so yeah I, I then began to compose using the instrument yeah, I'm sure the people back home are just waiting to hear what he has to play for us because you know he's being dabbling with the guitar. So I might just let him do his thing. Like, you can take it away, man. Ah. Of my life. 
big day, 26 was the spark of freedom to shine. Quick, give it to the pride of what I become. The long days in the sun, I'm a big old one. Cutting both caught at the same point. I'm a big old one. I'm a big old one. This is a music. I'm a big old one. This is a never done before. Things for sure. I'm a puzzle. 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 I'm a pu
Yeah, that's me, just cheap social platform. If there's anything else, I'll give you my. But you know, it's not just the talent, we also got the brains. You heard it from Mr. Just G. And I'm not, I'm not done yet, I'm not done yet. I still got the guy behind the scenes. You heard that chicky chicky, you heard that doom doom. That guy is coming up next. Stay tuned.